Hey, welcome to the show. Today I'm going to do a review on the Gamma Swarm Magnum and the Gamma Swarm Fusion. Both of these are the Gen 3 and both of them are the 22 caliber. I'm going to show you the differences between the two air rifles and show you a little action. Stay tuned. This is the Gamo Magnum and this is the Gamo Fusion. You can see that they are very similar. I love the stock in that very comfortable grip. They both have the same kind of scope. One is a little bit longer. That is the Magnum. It's a little bit longer. I'll show you. I'm going to put them both on the table right there and you can see, I don't know if you can see in that video or not, but the, um, the Gamo Magnum goes up a little higher. Take a look at the barrels right here. I really like the just just the cool looks of that barrel. Beautiful, same kind of stock. Here's a close-up look on the grip that you're going to get on both of these guns. Take a look at this. Just fits so nice in the hand against the shoulder. Has a very cushy grip right here. See those uh, uh, rectangle pieces there? You can take those out if you want to. Um, very nice grip. Golly, I just love the feel of this. And both of them uh, have the same kind of scope and you can put your pellets right in there. I am using right now the Gamo uh, Magnum Red Fire. Here's what the pellet looks like. And all you have to do is go ahead and turn this right here. Right now I have one in there and now I have an open slot. I go ahead and put that pellet right in here. Just like that. Had a deer fly on my hand and then you're all ready to go. It tells you that you have four in the clip. In order to put this little magazine back in, all you have to do is snap it in. That simple. This is the Gamma Magnum. Here is the scope cover, so it's easy to take off. This is the Gamma Fusion Gen 3, and take a look at the scope right here. I can take this part off right here. I can't take this one out unless I break it down to cock it. So you kind of have to bring it down a little bit and then reach over there and take it out. All right, so just that scope gets a little bit close right there. So you just have to break that open to get that uh, scope cover off. Uh, the safety on these guns is right here. You push it in just like that and you cannot fire it. So when you're ready to shoot, you take the safety, push it out like that. Now take a look when I fire this, there's not that much recoil. recoil. All right, see that? Let's go ahead and show you the recoil on this. Get this a little closer. All right, you can feel a little more vibration in here. Definitely a little more like that, a little more kick. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, I, I just love the power. I love shooting this. Okay, right now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the Gamma Fusion and Magnum and hit my wife's cookie sheet tin. Um, it's a very, uh, it's, it's a pretty good size metal, pretty good size thickness. And you can see already that there is some holes on the top. That was made by the Gamma Magnum and the dents down below is from the Gamma Fusion. Uh, today we're gonna be using the Red Fire. So uh, we're gonna see how that acts with <laughs> wow, with these red fire gamma pellets, I put a hole right through the bottom of that tin. All right, let's go ahead and cock the gamma magnum. Ooh, a little more umph, but I love the power. All right, let's go ahead and shoot that tin. Oh, 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 oh my goodness, you can definitely hear the difference. Okay, right now we're gonna use the gamma fusion. Ooh, I like this. Here is the Gamma Magnum. I like both of them. Hey, thanks a lot for watching the show. I love both of these Gamma guns, the Gamma Magnum, the Gamma Fusion in the Gen 3, in the 22 caliber. The Gamma Magnum, yes, it takes a little more oomph to cock it, but I love that power. Golly, it's so much fun. But the Gamma Fusion for shooting all day, as you can see, I was kind of slowing down a little bit with this one. The Gamma Fusion, no problem cocking this all day long. The Gamma Magnum, have to use a little more oomph with this gun. Both of them, I think you're gonna be very happy with them. 
Both of them are great for target practicing. Both are great for hunting. I, I just think you're going to be happy with them. I bought them both. I love it. So, hey, thanks a lot for uh, watching my show. I'd sure appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button. That would sure mean a lot to me. And like always, have a fun day and make it safe. Adios. Goodbye.